Hi. If you've ever found yourself in a position where you've put your CV on a recruitment site like Indeed, or one of the many recruitment sites, you'll often find that recruitment companies, if you've got a skill or qualification that's in demand, constantly phone you up all times of the day, any time, offering you jobs, offering you interviews, and then maybe not actually confirming the date with you, as happened to me earlier this week. I then turned up and for the second scheduled interview, I'm going to find them being quite um, vindictive and then cancelling it. So often you can get bombarded with these phone calls and you don't know who's calling you from which company or when and what job it's referred to, especially if you've applied for several jobs. Um, so what I decided to do, I'm giving Calendly a try um, because obviously I've come across it before but this week I used it for something entirely different. However, I decided today, after the uh, revenge uh, interview, that I, um, I would schedule these recruiters using a link to Calendly so that they can book a time. So. Um, they can book a time to call me, <laughs> uh, so between certain hours of the day, rather than just randomly call, calling me as you can see here. They can book me up to, uh, to schedule me in and then from there I can see if I can accommodate them with an interview if necessary or they can, what I've done is I've set it up so that they can, so if they pick, pick an appointment time, they then have to put their name, their email and other details in. Let me just see if I can find it. So this is the, the area that I've set up at the back. Um, I've edited a one-to-one -one event. I've made it into a phone call with a recruiter here and to last 15 minutes and have about five minutes, five to ten minutes at the beginning and five to ten minutes at the end so that I can read up on who I'm going to be speaking to, what company it's from and what job role that they're wanting to discuss with me and these are the questions that they are required to answer before they can book an appointment, what company they're calling from um, I'm going to edit this one out and um, what role do they want to talk to me about, whether they're a, a permanent uh, role recruiter, a direct recruiter or the type of agency that only provides ad hoc work and what date the closing date is so that I can sort out um, you know if it's a job that's got a, a near closing date whether um, I can prioritise that job application. So. Um, so they have to answer these questions prior to booking an appointment with me and I will send them the link um, if I put a job, you know, when you apply for a job you can submit a CV, I'll probably add that in or put it in a cover letter um, to book an appointment via this way or you can also put it on your profile and um, hopefully on some of those job sites. So hopefully this will um, this will then integrate with your calendar so it could you could integrate it with Outlook or with uh, Gmail or any other um, type of calendar that you use. Uh, you can set up email reminders, text alerts and um, these are the confirmation pages. So, if this is a good idea for you, you could give it also a try if you're finding that you've been bombarded with so many recruitment agencies that you get confused about who's calling you regarding what job and what, um, what interview they've scheduled for, but they haven't actually confirmed it with you, as happened with me earlier this week. So good luck giving it a try. There's two week free trial of Calendarly 
um, give it a try see if it works for you and maybe you could use it in other areas of your life as well okay bye